Hello European Union regulators, I promise that this video will last less than 29 minutes and 59 seconds. Hey David, I just got a DSLR, it's pretty new and I was planning on shooting long videos with it and it can only record for 29 minutes and 59 seconds. Why? It automatically stops after that. The SD card can hold a lot more and it seems like there should be no technical reason why it can't make a longer video. Good question. You can thank the EU. For reasons that escape me, I'm sure they're very good. I wasn't in on the discussions that led to them. The EU's regulators decided that any camera that can record digitally more than 29 minutes and 59 seconds at a time would be considered a professional camera for professional video work and would be subject to stupidly high import taxes and duties. So any camera company that wants to sell cameras in the EU has to govern their video to 29 minutes and 50 seconds. That has to be less than 30 minutes. If you, if you want to really shoot long videos, the way that I do it when I have an hour long shoot to do is I have, it's not the best, but I have some Sony handy cams. They shoot 10 minutes at a pop. I'll set up two or three, sometimes four of them, and then I'll stagger the start point so that um, when the video ends, if there's any, any pops or clicks, or usually there's not, but if there's anything between the files, um, I can cut to another, another uh, camera the video file of which has had a staggered endpoint. Audio from that is a little bit more important, at least on, on one of my models of, of Sony, um, the audio cuts out a few seconds before the end of the 10 minute mark. So that's another good reason to do that. It is frustrating to me no end that DSLRs do not allow longer recording time, but that is the way of the world. And uh, like I said at the opening, you can thank the EU for that.